Welcome to Spooktober! Where all season long we're doing Halloween themed videos. Go grab your candy and let's get started. What's going on everyone? Protopawn here back with another episode of Pokemon Infinite Fusion. Guys, today we have our set sight on Lieutenant Surge. But more realistically, we're going to try to at least get through the uh, SSN and get everything set up there first. Hopefully we'll get into Surge, but we might not. But that's kind of the direction that we're going in. Um, but hey, maybe we get held up and maybe we just find a bunch of cool Pokemon and stuff along the way. Like, I don't know. But first and foremost, we got to go talk to Bill. So that's why we are up here by his house. Let's get in here and see what's going on. Of course, he's conducting his usual experiments. Yeah, he wants to fuse with a Rhydon this time. Well, hey, it's, at least it's a step up from the usual stuff he's trying to fuse himself with. And, uh, yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a Bill face on a Rhydon. Yep. Yep. That makes sense. <laughs> Alright, yeah, he screwed up for sure. Alright, let's get this over with and let's move on. Yes, he needs her help. Yeah, of course. Let's go. We'll, we'll take that SS ticket. Oh, what happened to the Rhydon? <laughs> Alright, well, we got the ticket, guys. Uh, hey, wait, there's a set of stairs here? That's new. Looks like a bunch of the normal stuff. It's like a PC we can use. That's actually pretty cool. Alright, we don't need anything there, but... Uh, Alright, guys. Let's, uh, let's start moving on here. Looks like there's some stuff over here. A super potion. And, of course, we need Surf to get whatever that item is. So, uh, unfortunately, we don't have that. Is there anything hidden here? No? Okay. All right, well, yeah, we fought all these guys before we uh, had to take on Misty, so. And there's a bunch of Abra up in here, and I, I considered catching one, but. Abra is just a pain in the butt to level up to get to a point where it's actually usable. Anyway, let's move on, guys. All right, uh, there, there is the Pokemart here. You know what? It might be smart to stock up on some supply here. We have 5,000, so... Uh, Fusion Ball. So it catches Pokemon better if they're already pre-fused. That's actually pretty cool. But I think we're going to... Definitely get some more splicers. We're at five. Let's get five more. Let's keep ten on us if we can. And how many reversers do we have? We have five reversers, so we'll take five more. So we have both. And you know what? Let's take four fusion balls, because why not? All right, we're in a new route, guys, which means new Pokemon possibilities. All right, let's see what we got in this patch of grass. A bell sprout, okay. It's also a poison type. We could do something and make some pretty cool victory bell fusions would be pretty sick, not gonna lie. I love victory bell. If you guys haven't seen my uh, poison type tier list, here's a link right here. You can go see where I placed a uh, victory bell. And all the other poison types. Uh, let's. Oh, we're we're asleep, so that's not good. The static is going to go off on them. That's all right with us. It can be actually helpful for when we try to go to catch them. Get that thunder shock in. Try to get one more in. All right, perfect. His 
wrath is really really bothering us right now let's uh try to get this pokeball going here and get this battle over with all right bell sprout let's go all right Cool, we got that for later, that's nice. All right, it's getting darker out, so let's see. Uh, okay, there's an Oddish. We're gonna pass up on the Oddish. We should probably switch out Pokemon. Honestly, we really need to get some levels in for Bulbasaur and Madrin. Looks like there's actually trainers on this side. That's nice to know. <laughs> side picks. <laughs> Honestly, uh, it's actually kind of interesting. I'm not gonna lie. Let's go with the leech seed here. That's not going to do much to us at all, which is good. That's going to hurt a lot, is the problem. That was what we were worried about. We're going to risk it. Yep, him hitting us with Walter Pulse is not that big of a deal. And we got him, guys. Let's go. Come on, Bulbasaur. We really needed you to get some levels here. Awesome. Level 13. Poison Powder. Wants to learn Sleep Powder. Heck yeah, we're definitely going to learn Sleep Powder. Get rid of that Growl. Dude, we're getting stacked here. Um, yeah. Let's go. We need to get in what we can get in experience wise so I don't know maybe we don't do the SSN today I'm just thinking of like how much more powerful um, our rival will be on the SSN in comparison to where we're at right now we, we need some catching up time so I think we just walk around, uh, we see if we can catch any new Pokemon, train up while we can, and maybe just, just do some new fusions. It's the whole point of the game, is to fuse Pokemon, so I think that's actually uh, probably a good idea. Come on, we need to put this thing to sleep. Stop hitting ourselves, metronome. Blizzard, oh my goodness. Well, you gotta be kidding me, man. You gotta be kidding. All right, Madrin, we need to get you leveled up. We need to teach this thing Water Pulse. That's what we need to do. All right, Poison Sting. That should be super effective, considering Togepi is a fairy type. One more will do, guys. Even with our attack getting lowered... All right, there we go. Can we level up from that? That's the question. Nope. Uh, we are definitely not switching out. We need as much. Wow. Mag Kid. That's actually pretty cool. I dig that. That's that's pretty sick. Let's get this Tail Whip in. Oh, fire Spin. All right. The defense is lowered. damage. This fire spin is killing us, though. Alright, we need to switch if we can. Fire electric, fire electric. We really don't have anything for fire electric now, do we? Let's go to the Huda. We can't. We can't switch out Madrin because of the fire spin. Oh, 
that's that's gonna cook us. All right, well, it is what it is, guys. Let's uh. Bring out dude. Maybe just go for that poison sting. Uh, if we can poison this thing, that'd be really good for us. There it is, guys. There it is. Level 17, we'll take it. Togepi comes out. We're gonna stick to that fire, uh, or that poison sting, I should say. Should be a three shot, easy. Except the charm is really dropping our attack. It still does it. it still does it. All right. Excellent. Hey guys, so I just talked to this old man right here, uh, and he gave us a pretty cool custom move for our starter Pokemon. Let me show you guys. Apparently he, he knew Professor Oak way back in the day, and he had three different uh, moves for water, fire, and grass, only able to learn by the starter Pokemon. Uh, we learned this Grass Pledge, which I re replaced it for the tackle that we had. So, it's pretty cool. It's 50 base power, 100% accurate. A column of Grass hits the foe. When used with its water equivalent, it creates a vast swamp. I don't know what that means, but that sounds pretty cool. Um, so, yeah, our Bulbasaur is actually looking pretty good. Uh, anyway, guys, let's go and start looking around in some more Grass. See if we can find any more cool Pokemon to fuse with. All right, anything else? All right, I don't think we're gonna find much else, guys. We are gonna fight the Zubat for the experience, though. Bulbasaur needs its leveling. Wing attack is not gonna do much to us. That is the wrong button. All right, let's go for this Thunder Shock. Let's go. One shot. Let's go. Bulbasaur to 14. Excellent. All right, guys, let's see if we can go. Yeah, we're not, we're not messing with that, obviously. What the heck? Seems like you would find an item there. All right, Pidgey, looks like a day is breaking here. Talk to this guy. All right, new grass, guys. Let's see what we can get. Whoa, an added chew. It's very interesting looking. Um, I don't think we can do. Let's see, it would be grass. Electric? See if we can poison it. Nope. All right, we're we're not gonna waste time on this. Immediate battle, and it's just a normal Pikachu, guys. All right, Bulbasaur, we are going to leech seed this. go for the uh, we're gonna go for the full drain potential here just give them all of the damage over time effects that we can give them and see how well that works for us we will proceed to grass plan let's see what this looks like guys that actually looks really cool the thing had a berry the Pikachu had a, a berry. Wow. It's only gonna lower our attack. 
Grass Pledge is a special map move, so, you know. Alright, sweet. We'll take it. Um, alright, before we get into any double battle situations, I keep forgetting. We really need to teach Water Pulse to Madrin. And we are going to get rid of Growl. Alright, now we actually have something that we can do, guys. Alright, got a double battle with both of the Pokemon that we need the most leveling to. Dude, the Pika Duck and the Pika Poke. <laughs> Absolutely hilarious. Let's drop that there and let's. I don't know, I guess we just poison sting. They are gonna cook Madrin though. Gotta go to dude. We're gonna leech seed the duck now. And try to poison sting the poke. All right, both are seeded, so we're looking pretty good. Nice. Ugh. All right, we get the duck to go to sleep. That's good for us. Dude, the double seat is OP. both asleep guys let's go easy easy dub i just wish that madrin didn't die he really needed the uh, experience oh no they're both still asleep it looks like the one woke up i, I misread that All right, level 15 for Bulbasaur. Wants to learn takedown? No thanks. All right, Grass Pledge again. That is a really sick looking move. And we're gonna battle this guy. Okay, that's actually that's actually pretty cute looking. Cleffa and a Butterfree together. Cleffree, that's that's pretty that's pretty cool. Let's give it a good old leech seed. Dude, the crit on that double slap. <laughs> All right, we got the seeds in. That's what we need. Let's go poison powder. It's going for defense. thing is level 20, so... Unfortunately... We're gonna have to switch out. I don't want to lose Bulbasaur. It really needs another level here, so... Get that Ivysaur rolling. That's what we need. That Thundershock in, that'll definitely do some good effect on him.
Dude, this double flap is ridiculous. All right, we got him though, guys. All right, sweet, sweet. Oh, Bulbasaur's evolving, guys. There it is. Let's go. There we go. Ivysaur has been obtained. And uh, as much as this is really not that bad looking, I want to see what they got. I mean, all these look pretty good. Obviously, the ones with the vines coming out, that's kind of calling to me. Yeah, let's go with the vines out, guys. Let's go. And we're back, guys. And uh, while I was at the Pokemon Center, I realized something. Zubat is carrying an item that I didn't give it. And you want to know what that item is? A Moonstone. <laughs> so we actually have two Moonstones, and because of that, I think it's time that we evolve our... Well, actually, before before we get too far ahead of ourselves, let's see where this thing's at experience-wise. This thing is almost at its experience point, so let's go level up our dude real quick, and then we're going to evolve him. Get that Nitto King. It's a bit concerning, but I think we can do it. Between Poison Sting and Poison Point possibly rocking on the Pidgey, we should be fine. As long as he doesn't hit us with a flying move. Alright, there's the Poison. Alright. Quick Attack coming in. Alright, that should do it, guys. That should do it. Alright. Let's get out of the grass real quick. And uh, let's use this Moonstone. All right, guys, here we go. Nidorino evolving into Nitto King. Fused with a Mankey. Let's see what this looks like, guys. <laughs> There's really hardly any difference here. Um, wow, some of these look so weird, so weird. I, I don't know what to think about this guy. <laughs> like, I like the tails coming through on these, but honestly, this still probably looks the best in all honesty. We're going to keep this. Um, I'm very kind of tempted to fuse Nidoking, in all honesty, with Ivysaur. If you guys think we should defuse the dude and fuse the Nidoking with the Ivysaur, let me know. I think that actually would be pretty cool. You know what? Let's just do it, guys. Let's do it. Let's get it a uh, reverser. Must be up here, right? Yeah. DNA reverser. Actually, no, the Reverser just reverses. No, 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 never mind. We need to go Unfuse. Well, we'll Unfuse later then, I guess, and then we'll Refuse. For the time being, let's go take on this couple down here. We need the Magirin to get some levels here. And we will pair it with the Pika Drill, I think, because Pika Drill is on the verge of level 20. And uh, we'll battle these guys, and then we'll uh, get into Vermilion City. All right. With that, we're gonna fight this guy, guys. It's gonna have the Spiro. We're gonna immediately go into Pika Drill here.
Got the static off on him. That's beautiful. That's what we like to see. It's gonna go straight in for that Thunder Shock. Yeah, critical hit. Let's go. Easy dub. Level 20. Wants to learn focus energy. No thanks. We have a pretty good setup right now. Oddicate, Oddish, and Eradicate. Interesting. Wow, that is cursed. That is terrifying. That might be the one of the scariest Pokemon we've seen yet. We're gonna we're gonna need to set up on this thing, that's for sure. Let's get this thing some Thunder Wave action, get that para going. Okay, this thing has to be like what? Grass normal? I guess it could be normal poison. Nope, it's grass poison, or grass normal, I should say. That's good to know. All right, sweet. And we made it to Vermilion City, guys. All right, guys, let's end this video with a quick fusion between Nidto King and Ivysaur. I want to see what that would look like. I think it would look pretty sweet. We definitely want that poison grass. Let's go. This is already looking pretty sick. All right, here we go, guys. Ivysaur and Nidoking. Let's see what it makes. See what we're going to be using next episode. Yo. <laughs> That's so cool. It's like the... The evil thorn in the garden, kind of, like the thorny rose, that's literally what it is. That's so cool. I can't wait for this to evolve further. Let's take a look at these sprites. I mean, they, they literally went with different colored flowers. That's pretty cool. It's really just these three options, guys. This is obviously the sickest one. The Seed Drill Pokemon. To support its bulb, Nidosaur's legs grow sturdy. Once it uh, goes on a rampage, there is no stopping it. This is sick, guys. This is the poison grass type that we need. All right, let's see what we can do here. Uh, overgrow, power up the grass moves in a pinch. A rivalry deals more damage to a foe of the same gender. I think we're gonna go with overgrown in all honesty calm special defense up attack down or relax which is defense up speed down we could make it a special if we do this though it doesn't affect our attack or special attack so you know what i think i am gonna go relaxed Let's combine these move sets. Uh, we don't need Peck anymore. We don't need Focus Energy. Double Kick. I don't think we do Double Kick. Poison Sting, I'd rather have Poison Powder. All right, guys. Let's check this out real quick, one last time. Yeah, so our speed are down, our defense is up, so our defense and special defense are the same. Our special attack is slightly better than our attack, but we're looking pretty good stat-wise across the board. Even with 24 speed, that's not terrible right now for us. But we are definitely going to be a special hitter for sure. All right. All right, guys, that is going to wrap it up for this episode. Thank you so much for tuning in. 
today was just catching new some new stuff evolving and fusing i think that we're, we're looking pretty good maybe uh maybe i'll take a look at what else is in our box and maybe we'll do another fusion to open up next episode before we uh, move on to lieutenant surge because i think we're definitely going to need a ground type and uh maybe we fuse our uh, bell sprout with like sand true maybe we can get a, like a cool ground type going in there like a poison ground that'd be pretty sweet uh, or maybe I can go find into some new Pokemon. Maybe we could find some dark Pokemon. That'd be pretty cool. Uh, get like a dark ground going. That'd be pretty sick. Uh, I don't know. We're going to go take a look around and see what we can find. Um, maybe I'll do that off screen and then show you guys anything that I catch. But I'm not going to progress this storyline without you guys. So anyway, guys, uh, I've taken up enough of your time. If you like the video, guys, make sure you hit that like button. If you're not subscribed and you enjoyed the video, consider subscribing. It would mean the world to me if you did. Uh, and if you do, make sure you hit that notification bell. That way you're notified each and every time one of my videos drops. That way you can get in on the action as soon as it's happening. Everybody here, thank you for being here. And I hope I catch you in the next one. But until then, guys, stay safe out there. Take care. I'm Protopawn. Peace.